giving me his hands, okay? I, the old technique, just stay there, I'm not gonna hurt. Here's the old cop technique, and just imagine, he's got the videotape for real. Here's the old technique. Give me your fucking hands. Everybody seeing me use a nightstick on my guy that's really not doing nothing. Watch this technique. I want his hands, and I want to handcuff him, or you're about to grab him in an arm bar, so come over here like you're hitting him in an arm bar. I'm gonna be in this position. I want his ear, I want his ear. Now, if he's faced like this, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna touch his eyes. When you touch people's eyes, they tend to move. If I start touching his eyes, no matter how drunk he is, he's gonna move. So now I get him to move, I lock his head. Mm. Now I can't turn. I'm gonna take my knuckle, it's gonna hurt briefly. See that cartilage right there? Oh, um, now watch, watch what, mm -hmm. watch what my kid's videotaping right now, okay? Give me your hands, give me your fucking hands. Give me your fucking hands, give me your hands, give me your hands. Me your hands. Me your hands. That's all they saw, mm -hmm. okay? It hurts, right, it hurts. Now, everybody come and try this so they feel it. Put your hands just because he said that. Just because he said that. You know who it doesn't hurt on, believe it or not? Juveniles. Doesn't hurt as much on juveniles. Because the part is soft. Yep, yep. So watch what I do. I'm come here and play some music. Oh! Do you see the inside of my ear? Yeah, he can't do that to me. Uh, now, now just watch what I'm saying. Everybody watch what they're seeing right now. I'm not beating them. I'm not fucking screaming and yelling. All they see me is talking. Uh, uh, <laughs> you see what you saw? Right. You see what you saw? I got it. That shit's crazy. I can't do it. Now, I got to get your ears to this. I'm going to touch your eyes, right? Start gushing blood. Once I get your head, I got to lock it. This fucking hurts. You used to be nice to you. No, no, no. These two have it. You used to be nice to you. He was nice to you, yo. Oh, no, he gave me this. No, no. A lot of guys. It took a longer from the point of view. It works, yeah, and there's no permanent fits. damage. I had, I did uh -huh. one of his friends in a handcuffing class, Which and he's asking him like the next day. He's like, "This shit's gonna go away, right? <laughs> <laughs> this shit's gonna stop, right?" <laughs> yeah. Now, now you understand the beauty of that technique. Yeah, that's, yeah. Look what everybody saw. That's they didn't see me beating on you. They didn't see nightsticks. Yeah. They didn't see four guys pulling you to fuck up. This is good in a situation. You got a drunk guy that's just being an asshole. I'm not fucking leaving. Right. And it works in cars. Imagine this. Pretend you're sitting, I'm not going to do it, but you're sitting in a car. Cops use it. I need to get you out of the car. You got your hands locked on a steering wheel. Does the same principle. But you got to lock his head. You don't want to just be driving. You got to lock his fucking head. Works at a desk. You know, works for protesters. Sitting down, they're not leaving. Protesters ain't fucking leaving. Instead of running around tear gassing, we walk up. Come on, time to go. Time to go. Whoa, whoa, fuck. Now they're standing up. See what I mean? That's why you didn't hear YouTube, right? Yours is too big. <laughs> <laughs> so, took, but that's the key. The key is, yeah, oh it'll go God. away. Oh, no, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm going to see him at the security desk and be like, yeah, what? <laughs> what? That's why. Talk real long. Talk real long. Yeah. 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 No. It, it works, and the reason that it works, not necessarily it works because it's a good, painful technique, but because what he's seeing with the camera, that's one of these techniques that are important because this guy isn't fighting. We're not fighting this guy. It's getting him to do what I want. Now, normally what it's used in, imagine this. I'm not going to do it. Lay down. Imagine this. I'm really going to do it. <laughs> <laughs> imagine, and I really won't do it hard, but I'm doing this. Now, give up quick. I go like this. Give up quick or I'm going to do it. <laughs> give me your hands. All right, what the fuck? Now, I have my guys ready to either handcuff them or put them in an arm bar. It's not designed if I'm here by myself, unless I'm by myself and I can grab his arm and handcuff him. This isn't a technique you're going to do just for the fun of it. This is a guy that you want out of here, so you're doing this, and when his hands come out, your partners can grab and say, all right, dude, now you can get him in the escort and get him out of there. It's not something you do just to do, you know, because you can do it, and then he can put his hands back, and you can do it two minutes later. You know what I mean? It's got to be something that has a means to an end. You do it, he pulls his hands out, then you either handcuff him if that's the scenario. You guys don't carry handcuffs, remember that. Or you escort him out at that point. But it's not something you're going to constantly keep doing. But again, the beauty of that technique is all they're seeing. If you do it right, I'm leaning over like this. Come on, man. Don't be a jerk off. Give me your hands. Right. All the witnesses saw me talking. Wow, that guy's so persuasive. Look. <laughs> Look how persuasive he is. Kill that for a second, Nick. <laughs>